Scott Grohl from Easy Inlay. And in this session, I want to show you how to turn your blemish into beauty. In fact, this is how I got into sort of the inlay and easy inlay business. Where it all started is I had a, a crack in, uh, in one of my pieces of furniture. And instead of trying to hide it with some black wax or colored CA glue, the client would notice it and point to it and might give me a hard time. So I thought it'd be fun to try to add a little inlay into that. So uh, I had this crushed mother of pearl. In fact, I loved it so much, I bought the entire inventory from this company. And um, let me show you how to do that. So the first thing is I've got, this is sort of some figured uh, beach here. It's actually, it was very, very punky. And for what it's worth, I used the thin CA to sort of consolidate it. That's a, a good trick. So as I mentioned in a previous episode, one thing you want to do is whenever working with CA on wood, you're going to want to protect that wood, either with a finish or uh, what I like to use is a 25% solution of wax-free shellac and DNA, denatured alcohol. And I'll simply spray that on the piece. What that will do is seal all the pores and flash off fairly quickly. And then when I'm applying the CA, that CA that dribbles off to the side won't seal or won't show up as a witness line whenever you uh, apply your, your final finish. So once that is all dry, is spray accelerator down into that groove and let it dry. What that's gonna do is get the accelerator down in the bottom of the groove so when I apply my inlay and CA glue, it's gonna cure or cross-link from the bottom up. If I don't do that, I may get some liquid CA and if I spray accelerator on top, It'll, it can cure the top layer and trap uh, the degassing fumes in that void. And that can be a problem with your adhesion. So you always want to spray the void first and then uh, sort of work from the bottom up. So after that is dry, I can simply take my fine mother of pearl. And this is actually very, very special stuff. It is uh, super soft and very iridescent. It's my understanding it was baked and that baking process uh, softens it and increases the iridescence and you simply rub that in and it doesn't take much so now i'm going to uh, apply my ultra thin glue boost ca and i like the ultra thin because the viscosity is so low that it really wicks down especially with five fine powders if you're using um, mica powders or um key filing, something like that. You really want to be sure that the CA wicks down all the way to the bottom. And what that can do is suck those particles down. So it's not uncommon after this sets up to apply another layer. It's always a good idea to have your inlay just slightly higher than the finished surface. So when you sand it, it'll be perfectly flush and there won't be any sort of little pits. Again, another application of CA. And I think we're good. Um, I'm going to go ahead and sand this and let's take, let's take a look if it's flush or not. Sometimes after you sand it, you still might have a little pit or pinhole or whatever. And again, you can just go ahead and apply another layer of the mother of pearl. Let's uh, go ahead and sand this. So there you go. As you can see, it's nice and flush, a little blown out from the camera. Let's see if that is a better view. And I want you to notice that there were some little pit holes in the wood. So any fine pinhole will get filled with your inlay. So if you don't want them, you'll want to make sure you pre-fill them uh, with some clear CA. This is ready for some finish. Oh, I wish you could see the iridescence. There's just a nice sparkle of uh, reds and blues. Uh, I don't know if you can see that or not. I don't think you can. I think it's just too blown out with the cameras. Well, trust me, it looks fabulous. So that's how you turn a blemish into beauty. It works really well. And when people see this, uh, they're not going to see it as a, as a defect. They're going to think, oh my God, you're so talented and wonderful and creative. How did you do that inlay? Easy inlay makes inlay easy. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe wherever the buttons are and, uh, and watch out for other episodes. Thanks again.